a tsunami has engulfed several cities in Miyagi Prefecture. This was the horrific scene in Japan shortly after a 9.0 earthquake violently tore apart the region. The tsunami not only caused mass death, but has put Japan in a perilous nuclear lockdown, and the world is watching. In the United States, the state of Illinois lays claim to having the most active nuclear power plants in the country. Uh, this one these two towers behind me, as you can see, just popping up in the middle of uh, the world of agriculture around here. And there are farms with people living everywhere. In Byron, Illinois, along desolate country roads, seemingly out of nowhere, an ominous structure can be spotted from nearly all vantage points in the area. The roaring sound of steam and the billowing vapor clouds it creates can be heard and seen for miles. Some residents of Byron literally live right next to the massive nuclear facility. And every morning, June Hawkinson wakes to the 600-foot towers just outside her bedroom window. We actually come out and, you know, depending on the weather patterns, it creates different clouds and stuff. And it's kind of cool to watch, actually. I know that sounds bizarre, but... You know, when it's right in your backyard, you got to find a way to appreciate it. <laughs> Other residents in the Byron area, well, they seem more numb to the potential for disaster. Are you, are you ever nervous about something no. going wrong? No, I tell you what, everybody's going to go if it is. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what can you do? They, you got to trust what they say, so whatever. Yeah, well, when you see stuff going on in Japan, uh, I mean, does it, does it alarm you? Well, like... it makes you wonder, but what are you going to do? I mean, you, you can't do anything about what's already started. There's over 100 operating nuclear power plants in the U.S. In Byron, the operation provides 2.5 million households with power. Exelon Nuclear, the biggest nuclear operation in America, is watching the crisis in Japan and is concerned about the future of the industry's power. The uh, nuclear industry in the world, it's, it's a big supplier of electricity. In the U.S. here, about 20% of the power comes from uh, nuclear-generated electricity. Other uh, countries like France gets about 75% of their power from nuclear. If just one of these nuclear reactors, like the one in Byron, Illinois, was to fail, people from 10 to 30 miles surrounding would be evacuated. And in Japan, a growing panic is rampant with the uncertainty of the possible nuclear meltdown. Around the world, countries are on notice and taking a closer look at their own nuclear power structures. Robert Ray, Associated Press, Byron, Illinois.